Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of Grand Theft Auto Vice City. This is Tommy Versetti looking sharp as fuck. We're about to get on with the mission, everybody. We're about to start. Here we go. Oh, my God. Such a classic game. For those of you out there who haven't already done so and checked out my first episode, go check it out. It's it's just it's amazing. This is a classic game. I just stole somebody's fucking car. Here we go. And this, this game just holds so many classic things. I mean, legit. Like, it's just... All right, look, look at the game right now. It's just... Yeah, even though it's 10 years old, still a very classic ass game. And um, nonetheless, I mean, th this just brings back so many memories. In my opinion, I think this this game right here had like the best uh, story in Grand Theft Auto history. Uh, Vice City was actually very, very compelling, very, very good. And right now, we're about to visit our friend uh, Kent Rosenberg real quick, and we're about to see what the hell he wants. So far, I was I met Mercedes, I met uh, Colonel Juan Cortez, and everybody so let's just see what this guy wants come on Ken come on don't be a pussy all right funny funny here we go oh my god wake up oh, oh for God's sake it's you oh geez I'm gonna need new pants hey those psychos from up north they've been on the horn and they're coming down here soon now where is the goddamn money relax relax, relax. we're not at that point oh yet. I thought that you were taking care of this I really did and now those Guidos say we gotta do them a favor. You mean I gotta do them a favor? Oh, of course that's what I mean. Do I look like I can intimidate a jury? I couldn't intimidate a child, and believe me, I've tried. Now look, it's either that or Ferelli's cousin Giorgio gets five years for fraud. You gotta take these guys out. I understand. Help the jury change their minds. Don't worry about no, it. No, 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 no. I tried that. The jury case didn't go so well. So make them change their minds. Why don't you sniff right, some coke and go back up. to what you were doing? What did I do wrong in a past life? Cause Kent is just overreacting right now. Who's that guy? Who the fuck are you? Oh shit! Okay. Well. Some Florida moron. Yep. This takes place in Florida. All right. Oh my god. All right. Uh, go to the juries and do not kill them. All right. So it looks like I'm gonna have to beat two guys to like their bludgering death. So let's just get on with this, shall we? See, I knew it. A lot of people often were saying in the comment section below in my uh, in my San Andreas Let's Play, oh, I think they should make a GTA in Florida or a GTA in, like, uh, Arizona and shit like that. I mean, oh, here we go. I'm about to beat that asshole to fucking... Come on, where's my little hammer? All right. Hello there, Mr. Jerry. How are you? Okay. Yeah. Back up! Back up! Where'd he go? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, shit! Wow, you can smash cars using the hammer to similar weapon. Wow, that, that was the biggest fail ever. Get the fuck out the, get out the car! Look, look at the mechanics for this game, though. It's just so bad. Get out the car, be a good bitch before I fucking break. I mean, look, look at this. I'm, I, I, I'm, I'm legitimately breaking everything. Get out the way, bitch. You're gonna get hit with the hammer. Get the fuck out the car! I'm breaking this guy's car into an oblivion, and he's still not getting out. No, he's not there we guilty. go. Yeah, you better not. You better run, you punk ass. All right, that's one bitch down. I'm assuming that the driver of this truck is dead, too. So, I mean, clearly he is. All right, time to pay uh, jury number two a visit. Guys, it took me legit. I'm not going to lie to you. It took me years to beat this game. I remember when I was a kid playing this game used to be such a hassle and um you know because I, I i didn't really understand it 10 years ago i was only 11 years old i got this game when it first came out 11 years ago oh not 11 years ago 10 years ago i was 11 years old guys so legit this was my first grand theft auto game it wasn't grand theft auto 3 it wasn't grand theft auto 2 1 it was this game and playing this game oh god the first game i actually ever played was gta 3 but um what my first GTA game was, was it was GTA Vice City, I just ran that guy over just now and I'm gonna get chased by cops. And just, like, like, like I was saying, people were asking to make a uh, GTA game that, that would take place in Florida and shit like that in Arizona. If you look at it, San Andreas does te technically take place near Arizona, it's like California shit and you know, San Francisco and all that kind of stuff. Alright, get out the fucking car if I beat your ass. 
and Florida, as you can see right now, this does take place in Florida, except nowadays, if they were to recreate Vice City, I mean, the game in general would be great because the map would be a lot bigger, I'm assuming, and the story would be a lot more compelling. I just want to know what you guys think about Tommy Versetti. What do you think happened to Tommy Versetti? Let me know in the comment section below because we saw Kent Rosenberg in uh, San Andreas. So whatever happened to Tommy Versetti? That's what I want to know. That's what many, many, many people want to know, actually. I'm going to break this guy's foot. There we go. This is Giorgio sends his regards. Ah! Yeah, you better run, you punk ass. Oh, shit! That's my little mission. Fuck yeah, that's what I'm talking about right there. I'm about to Take beat this little fucker. Oh, did I hit him? Did I hit you now? Fuck! Oh, I hit the wrong guy. I'm sorry. Oh, God. I gotta got, got, got get out of here. Alright, back to Kent Rosenberg. We're gonna go. For those of you out there that are watching this, I, I'm telling you, I mean, be preoccupied and actually go out there and play San Andreas. Play Vice City. Play all the Grand Theft Auto games before Grand Theft Auto 5 comes out. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. Uh, because I, I just feel like this is Grand Theft Auto season for me and just I mean for those of you out there who saw me play uh, San Andreas that that was just an amazing let's play right there uh, certainly it led into like what 50 something episodes and it was certainly great I'm telling you guys right now uh, watching my San Andreas let's play I mean I had countless memories on there um, just memories that I, that I will never recreate but nonetheless this is a brand new GTA game right here this is Vice City who the fuck is calling me Oh, oh God! No suntan. We ain't got my money either. So I'm one of them myself. What are you doing? So tell me, Tommy, what are you doing? I'm looking for the money, Sonny. Don't worry. I am worrying, Tommy. That's my style because I seem to have this problem in my life with unreliable people. Don't be an unreliable person, Tommy. Please do us both a favor. I'm looking forward to hearing from you. Jeez, this guy is like so obsessed with his money. It's like, dude, calm down. I will get you your money. Riot. Oh, God. Here we go. I think I remember this mission. Avery, Here we go. Me. Tommy, Tommy, any progress? No, 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 no. Tell me later. Tell me later. Tommy, this is Avery Carrington. I believe you met at the party. Not in person. Howdy. Avery here Howdy. has a proposition. <clears throat> Haven't we got other things on our mind? I'm trying to keep the wolves from the door. So could you please cut me some slack? I'm stretched like a wire, and even if I'm dead by the end of the week, I'd like to think that I didn't die poor. Now just okay? calm down, both of you. Son, you help me, and any grease balls giving you a hard time, I'll see to it they take a long dirt nap. Okay, what could I do for you? This delivery company's got its depot on some prime land. They won't sell. They're hanging on like a big old prairie rat. So we gotta go in there and smoke that vermin out. Head on down there and stir up a hornet's nest. The security will have their hands full, and then you can sneak in and put them out of business. And you could drop by Raphael's for a change of clothes. You might be there a while, but yeah, go for it. Should be a riot. If the balls drop like they should, stop by my office sometime. Who are these This game has... Like lawyer pricks, rug-wearing pricks, surrounded by pricks. This game has some amazing acting, guys. I, I think this game has the best acting so far in Grand Theft Auto. Uh, granted, maybe Grand Theft Auto 4 had some pretty awesome acting, but uh, this one just takes the fucking ball. I hate using this fucking bike. Oh no! Shit, I almost fucking, that guy almost hit me. Like th In this game, guys, pedestrians and like vehicular like manslaughter is like everywhere. Like, God, look at this shit. I fuck this. I'd rather walk. I just didn't get the fuck off. Hey, mister, since you were the one that hit me, get the fuck out the car, or woman. Nice looking woman, too. Alright, it's time to start a little ride in order for us to gain access. Uh, is it in here? I'm not really sure. Back. Wait, it, it's gotta be inside this perimeter. So, what I'm gonna do right here is I'm gonna find the way in, which is right over here. Am I in? I don't even know what the hell I'm doing. I haven't played this game in ages, that's why I don't know. Alright. I hear people though. What is that? What was that? What the hell was that? Oh yes! Weapon. Alright. Damn it, Kyle. Stop running into walls. Alright, now where is the little riot? Crap, is it on the other side? Start fighting with at least four workers. How the fuck do I get on the other side? Damn it, this game is not having these strict guidelines. The jumping in this game is terrible though. There, there were a lot of things that were terrible with this game. I mean, that's what made it so great to me. 
Um, I remember I used to play this game with my neighbor named Camille. And uh, we used to just play this game for fucking hours and hours and hours. And not get tired because this game was actually one of those games where you would actually have fun. Uh, pop in a few cheat codes and your life is complete, let me just tell you. Oh, here we go. Hey, guys. Alright. You guys want to fight? Hey, <laughs> you got to fight. Mega! Back here! Alright, I got to start a fight with four guys. Alright. As long as I get things go. Oh, there we go. Is it a riot yet? Oh, fuck yeah. Get away from me, get away from me. Okay, time to steal that truck. Oh, shit, they're fucking shooting at us! Where am I supposed to? Oh, my God, they're all after me. What the fuck, dude? Alright, cycle through targets while targeting what? Oh, fuck, they took me out. Shit. Let me get up, let me get up, let me get up. That's a good one. Oh, God. Oh, my God, they're gonna blast me to death. No, 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 I am not dying. Fuck this, I am not gonna die. Oh, God, I, I, I'm definitely gonna die. Holy God, I'm gonna die. I am definitely gonna die here. I, I, I don't even know what the hell I'm doing. Get out the way. Oh, my God, no matter what I do, it's like I can't fucking do anything. Alright, I'm shooting everybody. I don't, I don't, I don't give a fuck anymore. This YOLO. YOLO. I'm fucking taking everybody out. Oh, th oh, that's what I'm supposed to do. Alright. Holy God, man. Holy shit, I'm gonna fucking die. I am gonna fucking die right now. Holy God. This is actually... I, I, I can't. Like, the camera in this game fucking sucks. Cops are shooting at me. Damn it, I'm gonna fucking die! Don't die, Tommy. Tommy, don't die. Cops are gonna come. Oh, my God. These freaking assholes keep chasing me. Stop. Stop it. Alright, let me just chase them out here real quick. Maybe that'll work. Oh, God. Oh, God. Alright, now this is my chance. This is my chance. No, 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 no. Alright, I killed him. Now it's time for me to shoot that barrel. Why can't I fucking shoot that barrel? I do not know why. Alright, I got it locked. Am I supposed to destroy this car? Yes, I am. Come on, come on. I gotta get the fuck out of here. Oh my god, I don't have that many bullets left. This game ha- oh god. Run! I'm out of here. I am out of here. Yes, mission pass, the thousand beans. Ah, shit! Alright, now I can work for Aubrey, which is good. I just need to get the fuck out of Dodge. Or at least gain some health. Shit. I don't have any health. Alright, um... Let me just steal me a car. There always used to be a car right here, which is oh crap. Who the fuck is calling me just now? Ugh. Let me answer the phone. No, no phone car. Okay. All right. Right now, definitely go. Definitely want to go. So actually, you know what? Hold on. I gotta go back home so I can get some health. At least if I can get some health. I really do think this game had the best fucking radio station, honestly. I don't I don't think there was any other radio station that could have compared. VCPR was my favorite back in the day, because like they used to talk so much shit and they used to just like pretty much ridicule each other over every little thing. It was just amazing and just it was fucking funny. I mean being eleven years old, for me it was funny as shit. But uh you know, times have changed and uh, San Andreas had some funny stuff, but then GTA 4, I don't, I don't know what happened with GTA 4. GTA 4 had some terrible ass music. That's why I'm hoping that GTA 5 really does up it up a notch, honestly. I really do think that GTA 5, I, I really hope that GTA 5 ups it up a notch, because if not, then it's going to be very disappointing. Um, for me, I am looking forward to that game more than I am looking forward to like anything else this year. Seriously, because I'm a huge GTA guy, and... Um, I mean, ju just for me alone, I, I, I just, you know, I, I just love GTA so fucking much that yeah, I just ran over a hooker. That's how much I love it. Fact. Right, let me see if I can grab some health over at the uh, at the tent, at the Ocean State, wherever the hell it's called. All right. What you gonna do with this? Hello. Hola. Is this Mr. Versetti? Yeah. Uh, this is Cortez. You 
you were at my party? Yeah, I remember. Uh, Mr. Versetti, it was a most unfortunate incident that happened with your people here. I know. I want you to know me and my people are doing their utmost to get to the bottom of it. If you'd like to talk to me more privately, you can find me at the boat. Yeah? Okay? Good day, senor. Oh, look at that! Mr. Uh, Cortez wants to uh, work out some sort of a negotiation deal. I mean, why not, right? Shit. Well, I mean, what else can go wrong, though? You know what I mean? Alright, I'm back at 100% health. Now I'm gonna go. Hello, hello. This is the nightlife of Florida. Alright, honestly, I don't really care about any of you, so I'm just gonna take this car. Oh, God. No! No! What the fuck? Seriously, I got busted? Oh god, who's calling me? Hello. Get to the payphone next to the mall in Washington. Oh wow. Yeah, like I'm gonna listen to you, faggot. I don't have my hammer or my gun. Any mission you were on will be failed. Shit. Alright, you will only be arrested if you wanted level five. I wasn't even want well, I, I stole that guy's car, but regardless. Get out the car, I'm, I'm pissed off. Alright everybody, well thank you all for watching this episode of Grand Theft Auto Vice City everybody. My name is Unvin Pin Gaming. If you guys are uh, GTA fans, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for all the latest Grand Theft Auto news information and updates. If you guys enjoyed the video, please give this video a like, rape and sodomize that thumbs up button, leave a comment in the comment section below. Stay tuned for episode 3 guys because you don't want to miss out. Check out my previous episode everybody. Uh, please recommend and share this video to your friends and family to help support the series guys and on that note uh we're gonna find out what exactly i need to do next all right everybody take it easy Frigga!